Hey everybody, Colorado Donkey Watch here. We're at the ADX Supermax Prison. Hello, Taylan. Glad you're here. We're here live with Eric Brandt. He's proudly carrying his sign. We're at the ADX Supermax Prison, Florence, Colorado. Uh, hopefully we're still here, all right. We got fast here. Made it all the way from to Denver and all the way back down to here. We've made a lot of distance today. News now, Colorado is here. <laughs> Floating seam and hello, Tommy Brown, Juan Martinez, Danny Boy. Glad you guys are here. This is where a lot of people around the country are sent. It is one of the biggest uh, maximum security prisons around. Timothy McVeigh, Terry Nichols, the Shoe Bomber, the Boston Bomber. There are a lot of people that have been here. We are in Colorado. Wendy G, Cam Lynn, Kim in Georgia, hello everybody. So the people in here are held for about 23 hours a day. They don't see daylight and then they get one hour of recreation inside and I don't believe they get daylight for that either. And the last thing they see before they go in is these beautiful mountains. I don't know, maybe it's part of the plan. Black Label, welcome. You're not a mod because I didn't do that on my computer the other day. And it doesn't have that option on my phone when I hold your name down right now. It's not about mods, Tay just wanted to be blue. Where are the geese? So I guess we got a black truck up here who is flipping around in the distance. So we've been here about four minutes, I'd say. This guy just flipped the U-turn. Yeah, maybe he forgot his lunch. It is starting to snow here. And he's now Colorado with his beautiful camera over there. Sorry, I'm not watching the chat. I'll be back in a minute. So we will be filming here from the public easement. This is a traditional public forum 
fun to remember those things before you go out and do something like this. This being a maximum security prison, they should have no problem with a few people with cameras out here. Let's see, can we do it? No. Does not want to focus. 98, Oz from Australia. Glad you're here. Denise Lynn, thank you so much for being here. So I'm going to be getting video here and then I'll be making uh, a story with some of this video afterwards as well. So I'm going to try to get some nice shots of the jail, prison. Hey, hey, Jason. Joshua Haynes. Funniest mother on YouTube. I don't think Hillary's in here. I'm not sure exactly. You know, I'm not sure that there's any women in here, to be honest. I'm going to have to look that up. But this might be at least the Supermax part of it. Uh, a male facility and I could be incorrect on that too Sasha hello hope everyone is having a fun time out there it's nice and cold here in Colorado it's not too bad though could be wrong, but I think that this area is the ADX. There's four prisons in this complex. I did hear about NNH. I'll have to see what happens, I guess. The flag's here, blowing nice. Ben Dover. There's another Australian in here. We got two Australians in here. Now we know it is a successful live stream. So I guess this place closes at three. We're a little late for visiting hours, so we'll probably have to stay out here. Ozark Hillbilly, welcome in. Glad you're here. Your news now. Thank you for coming. Tay told me to get in here or else. Well, at least we know uh, where your priorities are, you know. Listen to Tay, that's a good priority. Get some of these signs here. That one's not going to happen. Maybe. Jeez, Eric Saini has his gun out. 
I'm gonna walk a little uh, uphill here maybe, I don't know. Oh yeah, he definitely does have his gun out. Yeah, no one's here to be violent, so hopefully this guy isn't here to shoot anybody. They haven't even said a word, so... I guess that's as at ease as he is. I'm gonna head over by News Now, Colorado. Yeah, I mean, they, this is a maximum security prison. They're going to, you know, show some force, I guarantee it, so. Hopefully they're not here to hurt anybody, like I said. There are a number of deprivation reports uh, here. I'll post links and stuff in uh, the follow-up video that I do about this. But there's a lot of articles on this place. A lot of different opinions varying from these people are getting worse than death penalties and they deserve it, to uh, humanitarian rights groups fighting for these issues. trying to get pictures here but I guess the sky is I mean kind of a priority to keep the camera on maybe a quick one uh, yeah El Chapo possibly is coming here there was a video on that i just saw show the trespass sign please no trespassing federal bureau of prisons federal correction complex florence 24 hours do not approach guard shack so these guys are on the easement right there they're not approaching that guard shack WTT, hello, thank you. Yes, I'm definitely not trying to get shot. No reason to be shot, I think. I know uh, CNN has been out here in this exact location. This is as close as you get. They load it up, they fit for bear. Here they come. So we also have a ATV coming down the trail there. They're probably loaded up. These guys all just loaded up into this truck. There are many units coming out right now. We're gonna zoom out a little. So we are simply here filming and these guys have come out with an extreme presence. 
We are not engaging them if they want to engage us, that's totally fine. But there should be no reason to arrest anybody. I mean, we got Eric Brandt here, I don't think he's said a swear word yet. Evidently swearing on an RTD bus is illegal today. Those guys are just workers. Now we have the state patrol or the county coming in here. Oh, that might be the local Florence police. So they are just, uh, for now, making a presence and they are not contacting us, which is absolutely fine. Uh, if they stay to this, they would be absolutely, you know, this would be a pass still for a Supermax. They're not trying to stop us yet. So... I believe Terry Nichols is still in here. I'm missing, oh, that's not a sign. We got Pike's Peak Auditor right on the corner. We got News Now Colorado, who is not live, I don't think, but we have First Amendment Strike Team live over there. Eric Brandt's right behind me. He's live. They're just having a powwow, huh? Just assessing the situation, right? Assessing if there is a threat or not, which... In my eyes, there's clearly not. They plan on being there and doing that. That's fine. We'll uh, I can almost hear them from here with the wind. People pulling in, nobody engaging. See, I uh, tapped the thing, so I lost the chat, and that's why it was frozen there. Yeah, there are people talking. Wobbly boost. Get off my nuts. Hey, guys. It's a little cold, and I'll be sniffling, so apologies. So... Good timing. A wave of uh, show we're friendly or what? Hello. We're friendly. In comparison, we are, we're angels. So. Oh, you're right, I shouldn't talk. William, welcome. Shadow, welcome. And this, you know, might be what they're going to do. This might be it. I don't know. We got the Lone Ranger down there.
Constitutional Kim, you are not welcome in. HBO Matt, welcome. Uh, if I missed you, it's because the chat was frozen and there was a little blue button and I don't know what I'm doing, so I didn't hit that little blue button. EKA, welcome in. Otis Star, hello. It looks like he might just be leaving. He says, you know what? There's nothing going on here. Why'd you call me off of my nap break? Oh, what the Pikes is saying hello. They said appreciate it. Love it. Now, have you ever seen such a fine gentleman? on an upstanding behavior as Pikes Peaks auditors. I have not. By the way, in Florence, this is as close to a sidewalk as you get. Crosswalk. Michelle, welcome in. Let's get some close-ups on these guys. They're smiling, having fun, they know what's up. Lovely. Now, would you call that, you know, education? This is a supermax prison. These guys, as far as we know, have absolutely no idea we were coming. And they showed up, responded within three minutes, and now they're sitting around joking. I'm not saying, yeah, I'm not saying the guns aren't out. That's absolutely true. But uh, they're not coming over here to talk to us, ask for ID, ask why we're here. They're not going to interfere with our recording. These are the key things. What do you guys think? I think they're a bunch of fucking retards. Copy oh, that. This guy's got his AR-15 out. It's gonna go. The one behind the truck. Yeah. Yeah. He. He. He's over there hiding yeah. His fucking AR. These guys are joking. Way close to us, and this guy's over there hiding behind his truck with his AR. But. I guess cameras scare people in different ways. You got the inside of my brain. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, they don't know what to do, I guess. But this is a better response than I've seen from uh, what I would expect, honestly. <laughs> News Now, Colorado has got some funniest voices. This dude is hilarious. Well, hey, I haven't, my name's New, No News Colorado. I, yeah. He's been fucking around all day, I tell you what, he's having fun. Oh, I'm having fun. You weren't in the, 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 the car for two hours. <laughs> we're at O'Reilly's. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, I'm sure you, hours, you're right. I haven't slept in two days, you know, I'm just trying to enjoy myself, and it's very fine. I didn't bring any chalk, sorry, guys. Yeah, it looks, does look like a pass, I agree, for, I mean, as far as an audit goes, so far, so good. Do appreciate everybody coming in. Super Colorado Kush, welcome in. Anybody with a name like Super Colorado Kush is uh, is okay in my book. You got a five five six over there. Is a two two three? Maybe you went for the three hundred blackout package.
That right there is your standard M16A1 standard service rifle for the... Can I get a picture of your screen here? Yeah. There's a guy with his assault weapon of mass destruction. And you can't see it because he's hiding behind the truck. We got a fine view of our boys in the law enforcements right here. Oh, yeah. These boys look like regulars. <laughs> they ain't never seen nothing like this before. They're all confused and whatnot. This is a good group of people, and there are no loose cannons here. When these guys uh, express their freedom of speech, that's what they do, is they express their freedom of speech. And that's not maybe what we're doing here. We're expressing our freedom to record in public. I might be able to get a badge number out here. I thought they were going to make contact, but maybe not. You might be waiting up here. That exactly could like be. That's some exactly good like insight right there, the fast. Right, possibly waiting on the sheriff fast to say and not going to do anything until they get here. I thought I was fixing not getting any decent video, but Let's see what I got right here. Flashing lights. Man, I don't know why I keep doing this to the chat, but I'm not good at this live thing. I keep getting stuck with the chat, like stuck way up there. <laughs> Yeah, Kim in Georgia says, waiting for more backup? <laughs> it could be. At this level of situations, you know, you might need about 20 law enforcement officers. Uh, all stocked with the, the newest. And this guy here is on the phone. <laughs> uh, they took my picture. I don't know what to do. Maybe we can get him a thumbs up out of him? Yeah. <laughs> That no. was right there. That was thumbs up. This man right here supports the Constitution of the United States of America. Who all's with us? We got News Now Colorado, Pikes Peak Auditors, yeah, Fast, Eric oh, yeah. Brand, and they're down there messing with our cars, of course. Oh, well, there's two of us that just gave up our ID. And here they come tearing ass out of here. Yeah, next time take an Uber, no shit. Yeah, they're all cruising down here like backups. Well. <laughs> Maybe waiting for Guzman, huh? Man, I didn't know two cars parked on the side of the road was an emergency. But they called out the troops for these two cars. <coughs> Sheriff is here. I believe that's who is partly down at the cars besides the guys that took out of here. Yeah, looking up our information would be uh, retaliation tactics, kind of, so it's obviously going to be standard procedure for these guys, but that's not what I'm going to call it. Yeah, I don't think they should be towing anybody. This sh that sounds crazy to me.
hover boots, huh? Well, also not gonna rush towards uh, rush towards them either. So come in nice and easy. Well, if parking on the road is not legal, then maybe it's a ticket, right? Fast is certainly asking them what their cause for being here on his car is. Yeah, correct. It is a right away. It's a place where you would pull over if you had a flat tire. It should be totally legal to pull over here for a minute. They're saying chief, so maybe that's the chief. Hey, hey have a good day. Good job, I have no idea. They haven't talked to us at all. She waved. And is leaving. Ish. Let's see about this guy. Leaving. No, we there's no no parking signs here, guys. We're not we're not parking next to no parking signs. And we we try to do a little bit of research. You know, what we're doing here is legal. That's the point of what we are doing. This is a legal activity. When they turn it into an illegal activity, it is because we are filming. And if they do that, it is a violation of our rights. So that is what we look to avoid. That's the education we try to pass on. Uh, this is a non-violent, peaceful filming. There is no reason to get excited. They ran away like little fucking bitches. Run like chickens. I guess they parked down there like chicken. Yeah, correct. So if they do run the plates, they're going to come back to a couple people. Uh, but, you know, maybe that's enough for them, I guess. You know, that's, if that's where they leave it. That's not as bad as I thought. Right now, noise ordinances are enforced here? There's noise ordinances, oh boy. Happy fuck the cops day. Oh, happy fuck the cops day, thank you. Oh, that's so polite of you. How come the cops disappeared when I showed up again? You scared them off again. I think that was the sheriff that was down there in his truck. The, the one actual sheriff. Yes, or well, the, sheriff the, deputy? the the lady deputy said, "Okay, thank you, sheriff or chief. I guess <clears throat> maybe it was the chief of police, chief of something." She said, "Chief." Uh, he waved, said, "said you know, have a nice day." Either they're locking it down or unlocking it down.
If they're just now locking it down, that's like got Johnny come lately. I mean, I would imagine it would be more likely that they unlocked it down, but maybe not. If they just locked it down, it seems. A few moments ago, I heard a tone that was like in the 1500 to 2000 hertz range. Right, I did too. Yeah, there was a weird tone. There's been weird noises coming from the buildings. Uh, besides waving and saying have a good day or whatever, no. They talked to themselves, uh, decided whatever they decided, and they were leaving. We waved, said bye, and they both, they left. They were just like, fuck your, uh, fuck your shit. They all just swarmed mine. But they're all out here at the, uh, the gate. You know? yeah. well, they're coming outside, too. Yeah. EKA, hey, Blind Justice, they glad just, you're uh, made here. They announcement over the intercom. Reminder to all inmates if you're caught outside, something, something, something. <laughs> oh, I didn't hear that. I heard the low frequency tone. Yeah, yeah, I guess it's a bad time to be an inmate caught outside right now. Yep. So an inmate caught outside could turn into an inmate shot outside. Uh, know, that does AR, sound they've correct. Got, they've got AR-15s and shit out, so. Yeah, I, well, I saw the rifles. I didn't know what kind they were, but they were scary. Yeah, they're either AR-15 Shrimp Diablo at Jorge's in Pueblo. George's, Jorge's one of them. Sounds good, man. Yeah, we're not going to trespass Michigan, mister. This is U.S. property. U.S. government property. So I don't know how the service is out here. Hopefully this video is coming through good. I'm not screen recording like I should be, so. Look at the geese. ABQ Freedom. Just want to say thanks to everybody for being in here and watching this live with us. Uh, I do appreciate it, you guys. They're all kind of powwowed up here at the entrance, which is, we're making our way back up that way. Gonna interest you in any of you guys in scripture? I imagine if they're not going to make a stink up here, we'll be on our way eventually, but we'll see what happens up here first. The yeah, the sheriffs did leave. That's a good sign, right? All 30 of them. <laughs> All 30 of them. No kidding. Don't let him see Guzman on Eric's flag. They'll think he's there to break out El Chapo. Oh, I hope not. You never know what kind of miss... Uh, misinterpretation one can make from someone's artwork. They are conspiring how to escalate violence faster next time. Next time. <laughs> my hands are nice and officially frozen they'll be a uh, painful blistering when they warm up again we're doing a uh, spreading out here just so that if they do go at us they have to spread out too You can hear him laughing. It's a fucking joke anyway, huh? 
CDW was prancing. Donkey prance. Doing the donkey shuffle. Yeah, they are, Denise. I agree. They're showing the presence. They're uh, joking around. Yeah, Colorado, it's about to be snowing here. But it's going to hold off until we leave. Zoom out, come on. Do I see weapons not in their hands? You know, they almost seem like they're itching to say hello. Huh? Maybe not. Asking where the ADX is. Yeah, Jerry, absolutely. You know, I'm nice to people if they're nice to me, so. Are you able to read your chat or is it disappearing on you too? I can see mine. Mine keeps disappearing. It flashes up for a second. That's weird. Yeah. So Eric is not able to read his <laughs> chat. Yeah, well, I have to like hold it, which kind of takes... Keeps flashing on him. Yeah, sorry if I You're good. You. Look at I've got him all strung out. Flag whacked. <laughs> Five hundred dollars an hour? Hmm, I don't know. Yeah, right. I'm not arguing. They are doing their jobs. We are we are awaiting El Chapo to arrive. We might be early. We did not look for the exact date, but when he arrives, it could be at this time of day. <laughs> Joshua Shahane says hashtag Colorado Crew. Loving it. We love you, Joshua. Yes, sir. Joshua Haynes. Yep. Oh, my buddy. I fucking love you, Joshua. He's now Colorado. Appreciate you too, bud. God, every time I touch it, it just goes full zoom. <laughs> no, I don't think anybody has ever escaped from here, and I don't think anybody probably will. This is the, called the Alcatraz of the Rockies. That actually is one of the facts about this place is that nobody has ever escaped. <laughs> In case you were wondering. There's maximum security prisons, and this is a super max. This is uh, the worst of the worst. Everybody that has to be completely secluded, they have their own room. Uh, they get put here. I'll add some links and some more details after it's done, but we got Terry Nichols, Timothy McVeigh. El Chapo's on the way. There's a lot of people that are here. I think it holds 400 people. Holds 450, but there's 400 in there. Of course, too bad he didn't do this to his son. His son's killed two people already. That's why I call him Killa Guzman. So I got Daddy Guzman and Killa Guzman. So, I mean, honestly, I haven't even seen him do a cam back. 
Someone's got something. They saw, they saw Eric's slippers and they, they he was identified immediately. Yeah, so the sheriffs down there took off, didn't they? I guess start heading that way eventually, but. Oh, Denise is saying that he's watching the live stream on his phone. That's what which, she says. He keeps looking at him. I don't know. He says he keeps <laughs> looking at his phone, though. You got audio over there, sir? Or are you just looking to have <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I'm ready when you guys are, so. Yes, yeah, sir. My camera and my phone died. <laughs> I think these guys did fairly well. Although they uh, they definitely brought a big show of force and they went to our cars, so it's a it's a mixed feeling. They were prepared, yes. Yeah, they're they're prepared. in hand, ready to fucking go, in case you were wondering. Yeah, Daniel Seal, yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm sure they are, that's all right. Eric brought his sign, he loves that sign. He takes it everywhere. <laughs> he takes it for walks. He makes love to that sign. He makes love to his sign. <laughs> Thanks, Blind Justice, we will. I think he asked for a card and he is going to comply. You will obey fast. You will give fast card. Yep. Giving him some information there seemed pretty helpful. So uh, he says, I asked him if we could get in contact with their PR person, and he directed us to BOP.gov. All right. BOP.gov. BOP, their... I thought I heard Bureau of Prisons. Prisons. BOP oh, yeah, okay. for Bureau of Prisons.gov to get so into contact with their go, public uh, information I'm people. Go salvage Karen. Yep. All right, I'll be right back. Actually, sitting there. Now this guy right here, he came prepared. He's got earmuffs on. He ain't playing. This dude could stay out here all day long. He's got his gloves. He's not cold. He's got me beat. Hey man, I'll give you a couple gloves. Yeah. I got like three pair on. <laughs> Those are hand warming gloves right there. <laughs> they warm a lot of things. Hey, did we get a wave? You say goodbye to your fellow citizens. Yeah, I still have to he does, he waves, all right. Happy Fuck the Cops Day. I like, I like fucking yeah. bad cops more. Yeah, fuck bad cops is definitely a better slogan for me. But, to each their own, right? 
That's the beautiful thing about freedom of speech. You get to choose your own, and you don't get to put somebody in jail for theirs. I know. Because we were fucking, we were Jay Kaiser, we should have brought a pot to stir, huh? Yeah, the camera stirred the pot today, I guess. So within three minutes, they had a force, a show force out here. They showed up pretty strong. They went to our cars. Uh, they never did contact us. Fast asked them for a business card. They gave it, which was pretty nice, I guess. Uh, there hasn't been too many verbal interactions with these guys, so they seem to know what's going on, it seems like. Here's the card, guys. Officer Jason Dorman. He never even made contact with us. No right, well, he never made contact. He just gave us this card, so... There's definitely no, uh, no call to action here, so... Nice of him to give up that information without a fight, right? Need to start parachuting in so they can't find your cars. Yes, Bill, we're bringing a parachute next time. We messed up, but next time parachute, 100%. Well, I just didn't care. I <laughs> hey, guys, thank you. Oh, they wave, they huddle, they wave. Bye bye. So, uh, what do you think, guys? He's, uh, this is the highest security president in America. I, I, yeah, so I think how come is it that they didn't need to freak out, right? The only people that peeled out and flipped around in the streets and showed was the local police. Yeah. But these guys with the most That's dangerous scary. criminals That's in America scary. were calm, patient, and kept their distance. Don't get caught outside. Oh, they must be off of lockdown now. Yeah. Oh, I lost my chat. There it is. I'm gonna get home. I'm gonna stay there and mind their business as they should. Hey, Lynn. Glad you guys are here. It's good to be here in Colorado with this good crew of people. Uh, these guys are solid folks. They're not messing around. They value the Constitution, they are out there almost every day doing activism. These guys are the real deal. We got a honker. Oh, and he flipped a, a flipper off her. Hey guys, look at the size of the sand here. Uh, see the size of the ants. Jeez, those ants will get you for sure. Yeah, look, at the, look at the size of those rocks. Scary shit. They have man. Cybertron, ants how's it going? Stare down. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, if something's wrong with my chat. I can't read it. It's pissing me off. I mean, I don't like read the chat a lot, but sometimes I like to jump he's, in and participate, huh? Eric can read. He's just not reading your chat because he can't see it. Yeah. So, yeah, check it out. Watch. Somebody post a message. Post a Watch message on Eric's. You know, I'm sure that they're on yeah, mine. But yeah, they're, there, oh, oh, there popped up for a second. Yep. Blip, blip. Yeah, even if I touch it, I can hold it oh, there for a second. Oh, hold it. But it's like trying to go away, right? And then it disappears. I like your gloves. Those are stylish. Aren't they great? I'm gonna sell these. I'm gonna auction them used on eBay. Just put your initials on them. I'm gonna, yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna autograph them and uh, sell the Supermax glove. That's awesome. Yeah. So guys, from here, we're probably we'll probably do a live stream or something on the way home at some point too. Guard uniforms. I'm gonna say that we've got. At least while Eric and everybody's moving. packed in the car, it'll be entertaining. <coughs> So that's it. That's the legendary Alcatraz of the Rockies. Uh, once you go in, you don't come out. No, you don't. Everybody in there has consecutive out. life sentences. Some of them people have a uh, hundred plus life sentences consecutive. Really? Yes. Really? There, you, once you go in there, you're not coming out. You're not ever getting out of this one. You huh? see, you have 23 hours a day in your cell, 
And you have one hour of recreation. That's it? You, yep, one hour. And uh, you never see the light of day. The rec room is dark. Or not dark, but it's lighted so internally. Inmates walking back and forth? Uh, Surely they are. You know, I don't know that those would be inmates right there. If those are inmates up there walking, then they're not part of the Supermax, I'm guessing. Oh, or maybe be, that is be, their, yeah. their little bit of out yard time. I'd have to look it up. But well, you know, from reading on this place, they are very secluded. This must be the lower security prison. Right. Yeah, so I think Eric's right here. He's saying that's probably the bigger one because it has another fence around it as well. There's a fence inside this area. Whereas this one is much less fenced off. There's a yard in the middle. So yeah, nobody's escaping from Alcatraz. I'll tell you that. Now, Eric bugged my phone. Now I don't get messages. Oh, yeah? <laughs> no, <laughs> he touched it. He touched it and it broke. It's gotta be it. Joshua Haynes says the sex in that place must be amazing. Huge grounds. I believe there's 37 acres here that this complex has. Uh, I'll bet that's the 37 acres up there. So this is way more than 37 acres. Right. Actually, uh, So they are all still up there. They're hanging out, waiting for us to leave, I'm guessing. We'll see if there's any retaliation pulling over on the way back. Uh, needless to say, we'll be recording that if that happens uh, if we do get pulled over I would ex you know I would imagine it is retaliation we're not speeding out of here we're doing everything right do we need to do light checks and everything before we roll out uh, yeah I want to I think I'm gonna cut it actually for me I'm gonna cut it and thank you guys we'll be back. Uh, if we need it. Eric, I think, is going to stay live. I might go live later in a little bit in the car with these guys for some good comedy. Thanks for watching, everybody. Colorado.